Hi everybody! Perhaps you know how hard and often painful it can be to manually remove posts buried in concrete. In no way it's an easy task. People spill sweat and blood over this extremely labor-intensive task. Pulling one of these suckers is one thing, but a whole tenner is a different box of cheese. But hey, now you have this hydraulic jack on wheels. Give it five minutes and it's all done. Works great with telegraph poles. You don't even need a partner for this kind of thing. You can just do it all yourself. Pretty cool. And if you happen to have a rag jack, then making one of these beauties will be a piece of cake. You only need to come up with a way you'll fix it. And here's an interesting bike store solution. Not that it's a novelty, but I just thought it's kind of fun and interesting. When fixing up the garage door systems, this new and improved wrench can help a lot when dealing with anchors. You can easily use nuts on either side for these purposes. It's not always the most convenient way of doing it. So as you can see, this is screw pierced for the adjustable part, and you can see that you can still adjust it to the size of your liking. So when you start twisting it, it holds the pin better than ever. It kind of ruins it, but it doesn't really matter, because all you need is the size of it. You can take it off just as easy. Those of you who have kids probably wonder what you can do with the endless amounts of batteries. Well, it's just possible they have enough to make a small power bank. What you'll need is a few combined battery holders. In this case, the body is made of the tool organizer. There's a button and a couple of elements to increase the overall voltage for up to 5 volt. In this video, the guy managed to get over 10 amp hours. Now check out this lift. Very useful, very convenient, makes the delivery process fast and simple. And guess what? It all thanks to the electric hoist that moves the car up and down. And as you probably have noticed, there are rollers, and there are wooden brakes at the bottom. Now, roofing will never be the same for you after you see this DIY. Do you know what that is? It's a kind of multi-purpose trolley. I certainly didn't expect that. Obviously, some people could do without it, but why would they? It's very hard to put into words how handy it is. And so lastly, not exactly a DIY, it's still kind of an amazing thing. When I first saw it, I couldn't take my eyes off it. Alright, looks like this is it. Thanks a lot for watching and stay tuned for more DIY stuff.